We are live. Let me refresh. Make sure you can see me and you can hear me and that we are 100% ready to go. Nothing yet. Nothing showing. Make sure you get this off. Make sure the sound is good. And we are set. We are live. Let me see who is here. Get this out of the way. So many uh, tabs open. All right. Start from the front. El Gronk. Cutthroat. Uh, Snarkalange, don't trip. Robert, what's up? Saxon, extra grands. Flex on eBay. Lex on eBay. Uh, Felicia, starting the show off right. Five dollars on the super chat, which I definitely appreciate that. So, Felicia, thank you. Five bucks. Uh, let's see, Miles, he's back. And Echo, well, he was here last week, but he's back with uh, tagging us and finds going 100% getting uh, everything out there sweat uh echo flipping and freddy jimmy red drums garage see daryl my boy texas pete midwest thrift alex and jennifer bell little memphis uh hqq games let's see hustle and muscle zach a bouncer is here flexing those guns brosef alex landon happy camper willie will uh, let's see, where are we, man, Otis, and Faith Lopez, and Lucky on Three Legs, uh, Young Zay Westbrook, uh, Marcus, Alexis, also here, Tony, Extra Grands, I think we already said it, <laughs> Aaron, Omar, and uh, The Middle M said, what, oh, 199, did you cop Jordan 3 UNCs? That's a very good question. Um, I did not. But we're going to talk about that in our first slide, in our opening segment. Landon, Sal, Smooth Selling, and Richard Price Assassins, Russo Resells, Anthony BKK, and more people coming in. All right, get this out of the way. We're set there. We're not frozen. Sound is good. All right, so before we start, we have to start. You're probably tired. Uh, Doug the Pug, what's up? And Stevie D. You're probably tired about hearing about coronavirus, but here's the question for the chat. Um, have you been sourcing? Does it matter what's going on right there? We're 1,300, I think, in the U.S., 1,300 cases. Um, we saw, like, oil and what happened there, stock markets, things have been changing, people stocking up on toilet paper and hand sanitizer and Lysol and uh, basketball. We're going to have Warriors play in front of no one. We're going to have NCAA tournament in front of no one. It's going to feel very practice-like with no crowd. And uh, um, let me see. Let me go back on here. So it looks like California and uh, Washington and New York are the most impacted right now. And uh, does it matter to you? Uh, that's my question. Let me see what the chat says. Nope, sourced all day. Uh, let's see, uh, slums, I'm immune to coronavirus. Still going out and getting it. I like that. Let's see, hacks what's good. Um, let me see what else. Uh, what, money not, not gonna make itself. <laughs> um, I grew up in the 90s, I'm straight, still sourcing, don't care. Uh, nope, been out, hustle, don't stop. And uh, let's see, Callie in the house from Cell. And people just, uh, yeah, don't care. So out there sourcing, I like that. So building up that immune system. But here's one thing people aren't talking about. You know, how how are we supposed to pay taxes in a time like this? You know, we should just ignore it for this, you know, 2019 taxes. Let's just ignore it for 2020. 2020 has been a rough year. You know, Kobe and coronavirus and so many things going on. Let's just... You just not talk about it. Let's not do it. Uh, $2, menace. Um, yeah. And yes, they did extend it. So today, uh, we saw maybe today or yesterday, they did announce that they're more likely to postpone April 15th tax deadline. So there's a little bit more time because of everything that's going on. But I think we should just ignore it at all costs. But uh, Uncle Sam is not too thrilled with that. 269 DVD again and Jamal <laughs> every single time. Uh, we haven't had any uh Cornelius uh, um, 
you know, shout outs or anything. I agree with you. Down with taxes. I'm with you. No taxes. Yeah, there we go. No taxes. We don't have to deal with that kind of stuff. Okay, let's start with, let's get into our slide. What are we talking about? Uh, get this here and add to stream. So who picked up Jordan 3 UNCs? Now, I think uh, this will, I, I took this screenshot, I think yesterday or day or two. Uh, it was a lot higher than this. I think first day we were at like 300, 325. They did go down after people started getting them in, sneakers app and everything. So yesterday I took this screenshot, 263 for a size nine. Um, but how did you feel? Did you get them? Did you like them? Came with that UNC lid on the box. Some people care about that. Some people don't. Um, Jumpman on the back, which I also know people, if it had Nike Air on the back, does that matter? Uh, let me see what the chat says. Uh, quality was garbage. Don't care for those. Uh, I copped a size nine. Smooth sailing. Is there a giveaway? Yes, there is. Later on, uh, online got all the stock. I saw people reselling them for three fifty. Uh, so you don't care for those. Got a size fifteen. Uh, let me see. Jumpman was garbage. Um, having it over the box because of the virus. You don't want the virus just like creeping up at you. You wouldn't see trash this year, which yeah, the team the team does kind of suck. Uh, too many threes coming out now with Nike Air on the back. Uh, so money to be made. We picked up quite a bit of pairs. Um, I think people kind of predicted that it was going to do good. We talked about it the last show, uh, but I think it did better than we initially thought. So uh, congrats to everybody that did pick them up. Hopefully you sold them quickly because um, I do see them kind of going down a bit. Because, yeah, they were at 325 all around that uh, area, so 300 range. Uh, I did see today, though rumored fire red fours supposed to come out for black friday and all the other releases that we talked about which were uh dmp6 and flint 13s and fire red fives all of them got delayed so because of the virus now it looks like the next they're probably about like a week apart now um so i don't know that kind of sucks because i was really looking forward i thought fire red five was supposed to come out this month like late, uh, I think the last week or so. Now all three of those releases are delayed. Okay. Now also remember that Al Hustled, I am uh, coming to your city and we're trying to figure everything out. We have plenty of people that have already signed up. All you got to do is go to hustlerhacks.com slash out hustled and you can uh, fill this out and which city you're closest to, which city you would like me to go to. We're going to do sick giveaways and uh, meetups and the workshops and everything like that. So uh, me, can the hustle be? Wow, look at that. <laughs> and uh, Helene, Lister's sister, are going to go and try to get everything organized in whatever city we go to. So please go and uh, fill that out and hustlerhacks.com slash out hustled. And I'll remind you again before the show ends. Okay. Let's get into eBay souls. And I put a little bit more in there so we can talk a little bit more about these. I know people like the follow-ups. They've seen these in the videos. And, um, you know, are they selling well or not? So, hustle and silence. Will the virus affect out hustle? That's a very good question. Um, as of right now, no. But we didn't plan anything until June, July-ish. So there's still kind of some time to figure everything out uh but regardless we still want to go make things happen and uh yeah right now there's clearly you know a couple of cities that are pretty much locked in and we got really good email list filled up so that we can um you know contact everybody as soon as we know all the details how about hustle hacks cruise <laughs> from zapatos oh man um haha not happening in la anymore uh, let me see. You should not travel because because of coronavirus. And I do agree. But we're going to let's see what happens next couple of months. We have no clue. Um, I know people are panicking. Some aren't. Some are. Uh, but we want to go on as usual. But let's see what the cities look like. Okay. So the first one, we have Ibermax Flight at 3 Moon Landing. Men's size 7. A little small for men's shoe. And we paid $64.99 with tax. Came out to... 7036 and sold for 169. Tax came out to 181.89. Uh, 
And why are those PayPal fees so high? 1747 shipping cheap and super lightweight, $9.25. And our profit a little bit over uh, $80. So pick this up, Ross. And that this was uh, last month, about 29 days ago. ROI, 119%. So next one. Uh, Air Max 97 Pure Platinum. This is a women's shoe. Pick these up at the Nike outlet. This was about three weeks ago and got them for 53.04. Sold for 120. And I did uh, what is it, promote it a little bit. So $3.60 on that one. They did not pay taxes. So that's the PayPal fee we know and love. 378. Shipping also 925. And our profit we made a little bit over 50 bucks. Plane tickets will be cheap as heck though. Uh, I do agree. Uh, let's see. Glenn stay safe, especially for you since the immune system of an 80 year old. I do agree. Um, I know I gotta stay safe. Uh, are you panicking? No, there's no cases in El Paso area yet, but it's making its way. Like New Mexico is right around the corner. They got three cases today, regardless. Um, I'm still going to source, make videos and be out there every single day. Um, hand sanitizer will make more money than Jordan UNC. <laughs> Let's say I picked up uh, three of those still sitting around slow movers. I do agree. I was actually kind of surprised. Um, this one, this one sold. We're not supposed to do a $12 profit. I got kids. All right. Next one, Jordan. Oh, I forgot. We got new, uh, we got new sound bites in here. So that one was Jake. And let me do that one again. We're not supposed to do a $12 profit. I got kids. <laughs> All right, you went. Oh, this was uh, Jordan Four Retro Flyknit University Red One Eighty Nine. This one came out to two hundred three with taxes. Picked them up for ninety six dollars. You guys remember this Nike outlet video? I believe friends and family sale, and also about two weeks ago, profit seventy two dollars. Shipping ten oh two, and I did promote this one five dollars and seventy cents. So not bad on that one. Making ten dollar profits. Next one, Tempo Legend 7 in that uh, crucial size, 11 and a half, 12 and a half. Some people don't like either one, especially in cleats, but we did sell them for $139. Uh, no bag, no box, no accessories, nothing with it. Just it is what it is. And the, uh, let's see, 29 And with uh, tax, I paid $34.47. So sold for 139 eBay fee since they were I totally forgot to put them in athletic shoes. So I paid 570 or maybe that was a promotion. I don't remember. Uh, PayPal super high 1950 with the taxes shipping 969 and we made uh, $70.63 for the Tempo Legend 7. And is this our last one? All right, this is our last one. Vapormax 2019. I know you guys have seen this one multiple times at Ross and sold for 120. Now, instead of just going to return them or lowball everybody on GOAT, which right now people have them at $85. 85. Come on. Uh, our purchase price got them at 59 plus tax came out to 64. And we're still we still made a little bit over $40, even though. There's so many listings and go and I don't know where else. Uh, but zero on eBay fees, PayPal, 1366 and our ROI, 64%. So uh, that one as well. Making $10 profits. I do some go a little crazy sometimes. And that, that's the thing too. It's like, I know taking offers at Nike Outlet or Marshalls and making $12 profits making $10 profits. Like I know you didn't learn that from Jake. No, to flip it. You didn't learn that from hustle B. You didn't learn that from this channel, but yes, people are out there trying to make minimal money and uh, grow their, their business. And usually it's like the same ones we always see all the time. It's like IG, like six figure sellers and ballers and all this stuff. And uh, really no one knows any truth behind their business and returns and profit margins or nothing uh which sucks but of course that's part of the whole thing it's annoying from sal the ecom moose my boy all right call of duty modern warfare oh we're on weekend releases already so call of duty modern warfare push a t 
Adidas as we go. Oh, Dookie. 150 price. Uh, comes out, what, that was today? <laughs> Wednesday, March 11th, 10 a.m. Adidas.com and other select retailers. So Pusha T collaborating with Adidas once again on yet another colorway of these. Pusha back, <laughs> pass, and pass. And let's see, I need 100% ROI from Extra Grands. Uh, checking in, DJ, what's up? Uh, let's see. <laughs> so we got this uh, Modern Warfare logo right here on the side. Uh, does that matter? Would you pick these up? Have you picked up any Pusha T Adidas collabs? That's a real question. Uh, let's see. Uh, push it down the toilet from Tom. Pass. Coming to a Ross near you. Those ain't it. Uh, look for them at Burlington. Um, how many collabs can they fit into one sneaker from Miles? And uh, Sneaker Finds 12 says pass. <laughs> All right, next one, the Nike DNA series, and they're mixing it up, dropping this Friday with the Hirachi dressed in OG blue colorway of the Air Max 1, while the Air Max 1 is made to resemble the Persian Violet Air Hirachi. So they did like a little switcheroo, and do you guys even care? So price 110, and, or 110 to 130 comes out on Friday. Uh, let's see what the chat believes about this one. I, I think it's a clean shoe. Um, it is a little clean shoe. Purple, black, could go a little Lakers-like. But I don't think there was really like a need for any of this. Um, we actually didn't really need any one of these colorways in these models. <laughs> uh, straight to DDs. Uh, my favorite color is blue. It's hard like a Uh Let's see. Show the shoes we came here for, Doug the Pug. Uh, <laughs> let's see, nothing special. And Freddie, he, at least he's honest. I'm here for the giveaway. Bruh. All right, and clothing and Adidas Three Bridges collection. One, oh, let's see, 99 to 129 comes out also on Saturday. And clothing.com. And we have uh, three of the Adidas silhouettes. And does that, uh, I don't know, what do you guys, what do you guys think about these? Uh, let's see, Granger, Topanga, and New York. Have each been dressed in their own unique combination of white, red, blue, and green hits. Uh, <laughs> Doug the Pug, straight trash. Uh, happy camper, please stop this. Hmm, pass. Straight toilet paper shoes. Hey, stores are out of toilet paper right now. Uh, see you at Ross and already seen those at Ross before the drop. Zapato says, lame. Okay, now we're getting into some stuff but jordan <laughs> jordan 34 them bayou boys <laughs> do you like this one price 180 comes out on friday and after debuting on court on feet new orleans pelicans rookie sensation zion williams uh, williamson this pe colorway of the jordan's being its select retailers on friday Inspired by New Orleans Bayou Boys colorway in olive green upper, crocodile overlays, bright infrared accents, and Bayou Boys stitched across the heels in black. Uh, those are whack. Uh, nope. Trash. No way. Uh, it sucks. Just stop, Jordan Brand. Uh, disgusting. Uh, maybe if there were no other drops, I would pick these up. And <laughs> no in the Bayou Boys. Nope. Trash can water. Uh, I love this shoe, Who That Nation, and Super Trash. That's weak. 182. Man, that's... They're pushing it on that one. Looks like toilet water. Next one, Jordan 1, Zoom Racer Blue. Uh, interesting little colorway here. So 175 comes out on Saturday. Would you rock these? Would you pick these up? Would you try to resell them? And I don't know how I feel for reselling. Oh, well, collection-wise, mm, I've seen better Jordan ones than this. Um, I'd probably just be patient for something I'd really, really want. But second colorway of the Jordan One Zoom, which even the first Jordan One Zoom are still online. They're not even they're not even selling right now. Gray white upper, accented by semi-translucent wings, racer blue details on the liner and outsole. Trash. What is the inside color? Uh, I don't know. I guess 
I guess blue. We didn't even <laughs> we didn't even get to see that one. Uh, sick of Jordan ones. Dior wannabe. They are amazing. Trash. No thanks. Uh, we need our ones to be uncomfy. <laughs> I know I got to put in all this stuff in there just to all these insoles just to make it uh, wearable. No, these are fire classic. And if coronavirus had, was a shoe, this is what it would look like. Poor man's Dior's. I hate Jordan. I already have a pre-order and Mendes fine says nice for the collection. All right, let's go to. Here's the thing though. I had no clue. I don't even think this one was going to come out. Um, but uh, with all the other dunks too, but Nike SB Dunk Low Safari, and they're letting us know on Saturday as well and with Sneakers App and other select retailers. So Nike Dunk SB Low arriving just in time to celebrate Air Max Day and inspired by the Atmos, most popular Air Max One collabs. Now, resale dunks are fire uh, for the raffle. Let's see, this is a low pro, a real dunk from Tom. Easy cop, definite a reseller. Uh, but you would rock these. I mean, who would rock these though? Um, let's see, money trying to cop all the dunks. Uh, nice, let's see, coming to America feel very fire, fire big money flip. Let's see, makes me sad to look at uh, though. Let's see, all right, uh, reminds me of a giraffe. Uh, get those for the side chick. Uh, <laughs> Let's see how it rock. Um, or the side chick gets you these. There we go. Uh, hell nah, dog poop. Definitely rock. And hi. I, I think it's a clean shoe. Let's see what it say. Look good with some tan skinny jeans. Laugh out loud. Uh, these are why we love sneakers. And uh, those dope with some camel pants pass ugly. But we're not done with dunks. So Nike Dunk Low. And uh, just in time for, uh, of course, NCAA and March Madness. And now not be able to play in front of anybody, but $100 Nike Dunk Low Kentucky and uh, Syracuse. Hey, what happened to those off-white Dunk Lows, like a UNC and a Syracuse? There's supposed to be two of them that I think Virgil wore for uh, one of the uh, fashion weeks or something last year. We've been waiting on those. I've not seen them. Anyway, 100 for these. Nike takes inspiration from its Be True to Your School Dunk Pack of Dunk Highs for upcoming pairs of Dunk Low. And uh, which one would you rock, though? Um, does it matter? I think the blue one's clean. And uh, orange, you got uh, to be a special person to rock it, though, at least to pull it off. But uh, both are pretty sick. But I do like the blue one. I hate off-white dunks. Blue, uh, let's see... Uh, Nipsey Blue, and yes and yes. Um, I didn't see the Safari Dunk Lows on Sneakers app. I didn't see it either. I did look yesterday, so that's why I was kind of confused. Uh, Complex says they are coming out. We shall see. Those were the Futura collabs for Fashion Week in Paris only. Yes, uh, Futura collab. I remember that. I had it on the side, but we haven't seen them since. Rock one of each. And let's see... Are they skate shop releases? I don't think so. I think sneakers app. Blues are dope. And let's see. If you don't like these, why are you a reseller? Um, dip them in maroon paint. Make them FSU colors. The best shoe and skater vibe. So that rounds it out. And it looks like you've got three pairs to look at. Maybe four. Maybe. But I'm not, I'm not feeling this too... I don't I don't see this one sounding that great. Uh, so you got three pairs. Other than that, you can sleep in or you can uh, see what you can do when you're asleep right there, sneakers app. And then when you take the L, then take uh, you can go back to sleep and you can enjoy your day. All right, let's get into our store updates. And uh, Wisconsin, again, uh, did we talk about this story yet? When this one, uh, when is this one moving in? Oh, they already held a grand opening event. And the ribbon cutting in its little location on South Green Bay Road, which housed a Toys R Us for many years. Toys R Us closed its doors in 2018. And that's a nice little little jab at Toys R Us. Like we didn't know they closed. And we're not still sad that they closed. Toys R Us closed its doors in 2018. So anybody in this location know, or did you go to the uh, grand opening? 
Let me see what they say. Um, that one opening Savannah, Georgia. What Burlington, the Toys R Us. Uh, let's see. And that was it. <laughs> so I don't think anybody in this uh, location, but we're not done. We also have Hammond, Indiana. And Ross opens big box store in Hammond and opening at second Hammond South uh, location South uh, Borman Expressway. Anybody in this location now hiring, get that employee discount. Um, let me see what they say. Uh, what? Touch your ass closed. Big box boys. And anybody in this area, Indiana? I don't know, but I guess we shall see. A dollar, 99 cents. From Tyler, and we got poop emoji. So thanks for that, 99 cents. They couldn't have taken the picture during the day. Nope, they, uh, <laughs> pure darkness. And our last thing, which we must talk about, despite all the coronavirus and people worried and all these things going on, Ross does not care. Ross is ready to grow even more. And Ross to open 100 more stores as off-pricers bank on brick and mortar for growth. Ross, ready to dominate. Well, actually, there we are dominating, but 75 under Ross and 25 DD's discounts for 2020. So far this year, they debuted 19 Ross and 7 DD's discount stores. So let's see. I go to the Ross headquarters in New York every day. Willie Will, buy some stock. Uh, yes, more Ross fire. Um, I guess it means more shoes to, uh, for us to resell. Um, hope more, hope for more in Tennessee. Uh, let's see. <laughs> uh, don't sleep on DDs that no one ever. When will Ross buy out Amazon? <laughs> Imagine. I think it's kind of funny though, that some Ross have like the whole Amazon units and everything going on inside the Ross. Never would have thought that, but you know, Ross stepping up. Let's see what they say on here. Uh, and let's see, set statement. Uh, added the retailer intends to expand to 2400 Ross and 600 DD's discounts up from the combined 1831 outpost across 39 states. Uh, 499 from my boy Ecom Moose. Smash that like button. I agree, Moose. You gotta hit that like button. Takes two seconds. I gotta do click over it. Got that little thumbs up. Click it, and we will continue. But yeah, Ross, they're not messing around. And they've been five stars on our power rankings for many, many weeks. Everybody's stock is dropping. Uh, that is true, at least right now. <laughs> but uh, hold on. Hold on for uh, the long term and for the ride that's coming up. All right. Power rankings last week. We had DDs at one and a half, TJ Maxx at two, Burlington at three, Marshalls at four, and Ross at five. And this week, um, man, this week, uh, can we even show it right now? DD's actually slightly, this is how bad it's getting for these stores. TJ Maxx was on top of the world maybe two months ago, month and a half ago. Now they're down. We didn't even get any tags for TJ Maxx. We got half a star and a DD's at one. And here we are. Deal account 888. Saw some PGs out there in the wild. Undercover reseller with Ultra Boost. Size 11, $50. Those were our two DDs and no TJ Maxx. Uh, let's see, TJ sucks. Um, haven't found Jack this week. Uh, damn TJ. Uh, TJ sucks. Um, you should stay away from California. I live in the Bay Area from Craig. So that's uh, part of our hustled. We got to figure that out. But, um, yeah, we're going to lay low a little bit. We don't have anything planned for a while, but we'll uh, keep everybody posted. TJ Wax. And uh, let's see. Open near me, Ross. <laughs> uh, TJ Maxx was never an option from Happy Camper. Not messing around. <gasps> All right. Let's get into Burlington Finds. You got three stars. We have a couple of things we got to ask the chat, smash, or pass on. So let's get into it. Soul Town Kicks, and sure enough, the tats, too, with some of the cleats and some of the Neymars. And here's another one here, Deal Account 888, and at least GUI, also New York, New York. Got all blue on the Vapors, and Willie Will also showing the same pairs. Uh, what's out here? Nothing spectacular. Now, anybody picking up the Neymars? Um, 
smash or pass on the Neymars. Cop this one. Smash this one. Let's see. Sneaker finds 12 says smash the Neymars. And it looks like we got probably like good eight pairs right here. Um, then Tats clean, though. Dug the pug. Uh, pass. Smash from Jimmy. And let's see. One today. Price Assassins. And pass. I grabbed a couple of good sizes. I wish I could find some cleats. Felicia. Pass. And let's see. Wearing those with a dinner jacket. They'll have two to five pairs sometimes. My store is complete. Cleat dry and smash. Okay. Uh, Spaceballs with the same ones here. And Daily Hustle also the same. Man, more name orders. Uh, Fonts for Fun Hustle with the Tiger Woods. And Ron 23 Cells with, what do we get? Uh, soccer. We got more bats. We got Batman up in here. We got six bats. Uh, New Balance and some other stuff here. And let's see. Oh, no. Tiger Woods from Tom. I never find any cleats. Cleat season. I need those ASAP. Picked up size 11 in the Neymars. Smooth sailing. And let's see. Best thing I found at Ross Ultra Boost that are white with a heart from Freddy. Blue bats looking out. I can't find the bats no matter how many Burlingtons I go. And next one. Now here's a real question. Uh, smash or pass on these Jordan, what is this, ADG Golf. Obviously, I've not seen them yet. But Jordan Golf, are you picking these up? Smash or pass. Now, Common Fan Finds with a nice little hookup. Got complete with box. C&J Enterprises, two pairs. Uh, Edgar with one. And Damon with one. And they are $25. Let's see what they say. Pass. Uh, smash. Pass. I haven't seen those in New York. Willie Will. I'm kind of surprised. Usually, uh, Willie Will, we see his finds probably before everybody else's. Pass. See, does anyone in here play golf anyway? <laughs> A smash. Easy 100 plus. Tiger Woods cleats at Burlington for 25. Pick up. Smash. I need comps. Uh, wifey says hard pass. Retail. I uh, can't see what retail says 140 according to this little ass tag right here. Can barely see it. Uh, pass flooded. Leave it for me from Zach. Mercari from Sal. Smash and comps are up to 140. Laugh out loud. Smash. Balling. All right. Next one. I used to like it. We used to keep the name. I know. I totally forgot about that. All right. Next one. You have my word. Edgar. We're going to put the logo on the side. Willie Will with some foamies and kids foamies, I believe. And Rubber City Resale with Tiger Woods and some Vapormax Utility. Activate Hustle Mode. ISPA Flood at Burlington. Nothing oversize 5. And we also have another pair of Vapormax Utility in great colorways. Both of these. Silence of the Finds. And Willie Will says, yep, these are our six Y. Vapor Max back. We can only hope because it's this is not like Burlington. We've seen better days from Burlington. 2020 has not been the year for Burlington. Stevie D. Say it, baby. Uh, Stevie D did invade District Deals territory. That's probably why District Deals isn't even here. Where is District Deals? Uh, we didn't even see him in the chat. What's going on? We're not done yet. Lace GUI with Neymar's golf and even some Grant Hills in the back. Uh, picked up more like another day and totally different cart. We got Tiger Woods. I uh, can't see what that one is. A couple of golf in here. MRX Plus. Deal account 888 with the Legacies. Also the Jordan Golf. And deal finds with New Balance and some Legacies in there too. Uh, what? Don't, <laughs> don't disrespect. Uh, the Grant Hills from Jake. And I'm very sensitive. Uh, we're going to see, when are we to see any Stevie D videos? Stevie D. Got to find Stevie. out. I uh, heard you're a uh, legend in Oxen Hill. <laughs> oh, man. Stevie D. Oxen Hill. Uh, it's, uh, yes, we picked up one Jordan release. And uh, probably won't happen again. <laughs> uh, Jordan just on the Legacies. Uh, Gamepad, what's up? So he's in quarantine in Kamus for uh, our boy. Where is he? Oh, 
There he is, Noah to flip it himself. And I'm very sensitive. I'm everything that's wrong with reselling, making $10 profits. This whole reselling thing has just become, you know, clout chasing and who finds the best stuff. He's here in the house, Jake himself. What am I supposed to do with $12 profit? I got kids. All right, Marshalls, four stars. Uh, Marshalls, man, people finding crazy heat right now. I don't know. Marshall's on a whole nother level. Um, and some of the stuff people are finding is ridiculous. Uh, let's go. What a hustle and GTD sourcing and uh, 365 deals. Now here's a question, smash or pass. Um, are you picking up these junior hyper venom three elite FG? They're 1699. They are kids. They're not men. Some it does matter. Some people don't. Some people care. Does it matter to you if you walked into Marshall some random day? Would you pick these up? Let me see. Ross Shellington, I thought Jake retired. Oh, man. Uh, smash. Pass. Uh, let's see. Pass. Pass on the junior cleats from Sam. I've seen a lot of them, Gamepad. A resale freak says smash. These move slow as hell. All Marshalls got kids, cleat, elite, and nope. And uh, those are nice if you're a construction worker and you want to build a brick wall. Uh, that one took that one took way too long. Uh, pass and pass. All right, next one. Uh, Sneaky flips, who is uh, everywhere, and we have seven twenties, and we got four pairs here. Uh, soul searchings on with fifty dollars for those seven twenty Saturns, which you could barely even see it right here. Um, got cut off, but showing what about five or six pairs? Sneaker finds twelve with the Air Force One at thirty five dollars. And I was looking at uh, some listings on this one. Small sizes, not bad. Some of the bigger sizes, I'm like, why are these? Some people selling them for like eighty five bucks. Like, come on, man. Uh, but I definitely like that Air Force One. Optimal kicks and 7Y, of course, the legacy low we've seen. And then randomly a Dornbecker 95. So I don't know. I don't know if it's from Marshall's because it didn't say. Uh, I don't see Marshall's tag, nothing like that. But I do know some outlets are getting these. Uh, let's see, go back up. Um, let's see, where are we? NBA season suspended from Red Tangos and Hustle and Silence. Um, see, slap a Supreme sticker on them. NBA suspended season um, after tonight's games. Um, the oh man, now NBA coming out everywhere. I don't even see anything. I don't see on my phone. I don't see anything about NBA. Uh, we'll see if anything happens. But I do know that, oh, something sold. Very nice. Anyway, I guess my Marshall is trash and yo. All right, next one. Willie Will with the 97s, cam digital camo 97s. Extra 15, we got the Air Max 1 and Air Max 90. $50 for some reason, no box. Sneaky flips with the same ones. And we got the Air Max Deluxe, $29. Um, Hustle Don't Stop, 81. And super cheap, complete with box, Air Max Deluxe. I finally got rid of the ones I had, and I'm glad I don't have to see them anymore um next one breezy finds we got air max these are pretty clean though air max 95 um same thing with 365 deals with the black and gold um also very clean uh 95s i like the black and gold I like the little little combo I, I think it's a clean shoe 80 dollars though what happened there 80 bucks for these 95s and then 60 bucks for the blue ones now breezy finds that's the price we know and love. $45 for all red Air Max Plus. This one is a pretty sick find. LA Thrifter Hunter uh, with Air Max 1. And uh, how much were these anyway? $39? Man, for both? This guy's picking up a lot. Of, I mean, he's always picked up good stuff, but man, um, that's crazy stuff right there. $39 bucks for these. Uh, let me see. Then Blue 95s. Uh, Wall Street continues to plunge after Trump suspends Euro travel. Um, here's the thing, too, though, is like we got to look at the stock market. We got to see what's going on 
in general and how people are spending their money. And we, we want them to make sure they're still buying shoes. But if it gets to a point where they are not and we're depending on things we actually need, um, then that's where it comes a little iffy. And hopefully you have money saved. Hopefully you have some capital. And in that case, when things do start plunging, then you're at the key time to buy. I guarantee you, if people need money and they are selling off brand new shoes they haven't worn, things like that, GOAT, Stock X, and they're extremely low and you have the capital, definitely buy them up. Wait it out after all the stuff, after everything kind of clears up, we're in better shape. You will make great money on that. But it's down the road. Let's see what happens. Hopefully, we don't get to that point. And in general, our you know economy and everything stays. But as of right now, um, we don't know yet. All right, Thrifting Together, Stevie D, both with the phone posits and Weston Flips and Russo Resales, also with the men's phone posits. So women's and men's. And it looks like these are, what, 69? Yeah, 70 bucks, I think. And these are 70 or 75? Uh, don't buy the used shoes from Zapatos. <laughs> All right, next one. Uh, Willie Will with the uh, flight posit. We got more foams on here from Willie Will. Uh, Willie Will on three of these photos, sneaky flips with the uh, Air Max 90, Air Max 1, and again with the 90 camo, digital camo 90s. And now we're getting into some brand, well, not these, but today we flip. Look at these Ultra Boost 20. Like, how did these already make it here? Marshall's 50 bucks, three size nine. Uh, what's going on here? So what do you think about this one? Smash or pass, but 50 bucks. I was really surprised to see uh, these were already at Marshall's Ultra Boost. And we have some of the older ones, but $60. I mean, this is, we've seen somewhat. Uh, but this one, what the heck? <laughs> Dang, wow. Uh, and then NJ uh, Sneaker Finds. Then we got Flight Posit 2 Olympic, $50. Two pairs here. Sneaky flips yet again with the Flyknit Vapormax, Vapormax 2019 in gold and red. Activate hustle mode. And then sneaky flips, Airmax Plus 97, Hustle B, uh, hustle B colorway. And then we got the, uh, what, look at this, $50 complete with box, even has all the little pins, all that. And it looks like the, uh, I mean, the same ones that we've been seeing at Ross, so. 50 bucks too. Um, let me see. Who are we? Have a look at these finds. Sold to Stranger Things next day, 150. Small size. Uh, man, it's wild. Um, how? Question mark. Uh, let's see. Give me 30 Wowzers. And man, my Marshalls is straight trash. I haven't seen any of this kind of stuff. Um, went today to all of our marshals i didn't see anything but i'm gonna keep going this week hopefully hopefully something this is gonna be ridiculous <laughs> now we're getting to ross and five stars as usual our giveaway is also gonna be from ross uh they've been dominating no one's be able to take them down but marshals may be getting close but right now ross just so uh, many finds and categories all the way around even stuff that I'm really surprised um, people have been finding. So NBA suspends all games. So suspended right now. And what apparently, let's see, reportedly Rudy Gobert uh, tested positive for coronavirus. So that's pretty crazy. All right, Breezy finds and with two pairs of the Air Force Ones at 65 and yeah, 65 bucks on both. One lady hustler out here with Air, uh, Air Force One again. And these are pretty cool with the swooshes interchangeable. 55 bucks. Deal account 888. Uh, Flu-like symptoms. Uh, didn't didn't um, Steph Curry also have flu? But apparently he got tested for coronavirus and it wasn't that. But he did have flu. Next one, Jim Minaj. This is pretty cool. Inside out Air Force One high. $65 size 7. Uh, Texas Pete, $55 Air Force One low. This is pretty cool. USA, two more pairs here. Deal account 888 and Wisco Closet. And I think someone found these last uh, last week too in the live show. Uh, so that's pretty cool. Air Force One NBA Finals. 
So not bad. Uh, so uh, some up tempos up in here. Ronzo's 15 with that wheat up tempo, $65. We got the Georgetown size 14, at least still a human size, $65 from DMV. And GT sourcing, we got the up tempos, camo up tempos for kids. We can see no air bubble units in here. And then Cam Pepper also with kids size seven. And uh, this one we've also seen a couple of times too. So up tempos, all four of them. Them Georgetowns though. Here we go. Getting to 97s and 97 plus. This one's a sick colorway though. Like a nice little orange swoosh on there. One Lady Hustler. Congrats on that one. $69 for the 97s. Probably just a small size. That's all we've been seeing for these. 365 deals too. Different kind of 97. Mile High Hustle. Red, white, and blue. 97 at 65 uh, $5 Ecom Moose for the face mask, hand sanitizer, TB fund. All right, oh man, Ecom Moose, thank you for that. We'll add that in um, <laughs> for the super chat. So $4.99. All right, smash your pass on the Gary Paytons. Do we have any fans of the GPs? Where's Jake? Is Jake still here? Jake, would you rock these? Making $10 profits. And are they selling well? Maroon GPs. And the man, Mr. Information in Hand, Weston Flips, and Hustle Crow. And Hustle Crow, by the way, I don't know if he's here, but he has a Kobe jersey that I need. Um, <laughs> so if you've gone to my store, I'm selling some of my older, like, not all well, some are older, but bigger jerseys that just don't fit at all. I need to sell these to buy this one jersey from Hustle Crow. So if Hustle Crow's out there, then uh, oh, there he is, yo. <laughs> so I am selling even an uh, Dan Marino. It's too big, but I did buy another Marino that fits me. But it is authentic, um, Shaq authentic. So some good stuff in there. Uh, let's see your '90s baggy jerseys. <laughs> uh, Note to flip it. Let's see yo, um, Christy says pass, pass, and let's see GP is a go for me. Smooth selling. My Ross had five pair. Um, <laughs> let me see, where are we? Coronavirus going to spread like wildfire at Utah. I don't like to hear that. Missed the early 2000s silk jerseys. Reminds me of like the Nuggets Carmelo, that like silky smooth jersey. Sin City Hustle and uh, Hustler Rhino with the T-Max. These are not original T-Max. They are T-Max with the boost and $30. I believe we saw these at TJ Maxx during Christmas time. CNJ Enterprises with the Jordan 1 Rebel, I believe, or 20 Rebel. What are they, what do they call these? <laughs> uh, anyways, I did see these, though, at my Ross. They did not. They were not selling that great. Um, only one pair, though, and even then, they were pretty scuffed. Um, you also got to keep keep track of all this to make sure they're in good shape. And uh, Mile High Hustle, two of them, of the Air Force One Jester. Let's see. Carolina Kicks and Weston Flips. We got Vapor Max Plus, two pairs of Vapor Max 2019, another pair of Vapor Max 2019, 365 deals. But that price we know and love at $40. So we never really see that. They're mostly like 60, 70. And flipping for funds, $50 for Vapor Max Plus and that gradient pink to uh, like yellow gradient. Now we start with the Kobe's. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Kobe's, $39, size 18. These are pretty big right here. But Jay Minaj found two pairs of those. Dapper Fanatic, which actually found a size 10 or 10 and a half. So congrats on that one. Oh, uh, Kobe 80 only found one size 9. So that's that's pretty rare. We just see the big sizes. 40 bucks on this one. we got the green one, same thing. And then size 14. 14, very doable. What a hustle. And we also got some LeBron soldiers in the back. Carolina Kicks. We got the all-white 270. We got A7 resells. A nice little colorway there in the 270. Hustler Rhino with the red 720, 60 bucks. And Ronzo's with the 95s, $65. I don't know what this colorway is called, though, but it's kind of cool. Haven't seen that one. Let me see. I skipped a ton of Kobe's in District Deals land. Stevie D. Stevie. Man. Where is... I mean, District Deals isn't even out here to defend himself. 
Uh, we got Tans Finds, Hella Finds, 87 resells, and Bofo merchandise. We got 97s all around. These are probably like size five or six or something. I haven't seen any good sizes at all for these. And they're all 70 bucks. I don't know how that happened. Uh, but hopefully we can see some uh, bigger sizes out there. Some of the smaller ones do sell. But five, I think I saw like a five and a half. I was like, it's tough. And then uh, 95s, these are pretty sick. Splatter. Women's splatter. Uh, let's see. Hope uh, United 3 goes to Marshall since it's sitting. 199, Super Chat, the middle them. Appreciate that. Two bucks. Now, Martino finds and hustle in silence with the cleats. The cleats are coming back. Women's cleats, $20, size 10. And compare at 158. Pretty sick. Pick, uh, pick these up. Silence of the Finds, they got Vapor 360 and uh, Kid Junior 24, $35 on the Safari Golf. That one you're definitely picking up. Hustler Rhino with the Air Max 98, Stone Builder 23. We got Vapor Max Utility, Air Force One Low, and we got some Air Max Plus. I can't really see if they're 97 or just Plus. Uh, Drum the Hustler with Dornbecker React Element, size eight fifty dollars uh, Smasher Pass, would you rock these? Would you sell these? And Demand Misinformation, uh, $55 for uh, the Force, I guess you could say Barclays, or I don't know if Barclays actually wore these, did he? Uh, red and Black. Sell Pass from Miles on the React. And that's it so far. <laughs> uh, definitely rock the Dornbeckers. Definitely sell them. Waiting on Gore-Tex Chucks and Smash both ways. Faith Lopez with the Team USA jersey. Look at that retail. 165 Picked them up for $12.99. LA Thrifter Hunter with the 410 retail fry boots. And I don't know how much he paid for them, but those are pretty sick. And then Suspicious Thrifter. Two pairs of the Vapormax. And then we have Faith Lopez again with the Project Rock. And these are pretty cool, $40. And yeah, definitely, uh, I don't know how well these are selling though compared to the other ones, but I haven't seen Project Rock shoes in a couple of months, I think. All right, uh, let's see, anything else? Oh, that jersey at Burlington. Uh, we need a Hustler Hacks colorway. <laughs> uh, let's see, how do we, uh, there we go, all right. Uh, next one, we have Thrifting Wizard and 365 Deals and Florida Flipping and Smooth Sailing. And we got some Legacies. We got the Tennis. We got the Boots. We also got the Air Force One Low. We got Katie's, Kyrie's, and Kobe's. And then we got 270s. We got the Cortez. We just got these Cortez at my outlets, actually. Vapor Max, Flyknit, and a couple of Kobe's in there. And then again... Flying it and some foamies and shocks and Air Max Plus, man. Let's see, is Raise a good place to buy off gift cards or a scam? No, it's definitely a good place. Um, they used to be a lot better as far as the discounts you would get, but lately I've been seeing like 2%, some a little bit less. I don't know. It's a little, you got to keep track of it, be on top of things at all, at all times. Um, See anyone else possible clean off excess glue or shoe glue? Um, I haven't tried that ink be gone. It might take some off. It just depends also how much glue is on there. I've seen some bad ones. Uh, Rubber City Resale. Oh man. Uh, this is actually he found this shoe with like a whole cart full of things. But this one, $35 for the Bl Stussy Blazers. And look at this. Um, I don't know if it says no box or not, whatever. It doesn't matter because it's 35. But yes, you are picking these up. Mile High Hustle with the foam posits. We got two pairs of Prestos, 365 deals. Arizona Fines, $40 size 10, all white. Let's see, Chris Sneaker Deals. We got the Kyrie Sneaker Flip. We got the Inside Out Air Max One. Bofo Merchandise with the KDs. Mile High Hustle with the Dunks. 35 bucks. Uh, yes, we're going to talk about those Stussy Blazers. They come out again. 
uh, GTD sourcing with the LeBrons. LeBron 15 graffiti size 18. It looks like more people finding some of the bigger sizes. Uh, common fan finds. Uh, Silence of the finds with the Vapor Max flying it. We haven't seen this one since the Burlington days when people picked this one. Who picked this one up? I know a couple of people did. Um, I love this colorway. Pretty sick. Just random. Uh, but now they're coming up at Ross. That's good. One hit a flip. Also $75 for the acronym Vapor Max. All right. Super 6-4 with a couple of Kobe's. And we got some Jordan 9 cleats. And what are they? 20? Oh, $16.99. Uh, Edgar also with Kobe's and NMD. Some stuff back there. Flipping for funds. We got the foam posits, 270s, and Legacy. And uh, the re project, we got Wheat Up Tempos, Safari Golf, Gore Tex Boots. We also got the Penny, the Zoom Rookies. Nice. I mean, pff, a couple of finds are here. Someone had a great day on that one. Uh, next one Ronzo's 15. I can't believe people are. I have not seen anything like this, uh, but Ronzo's, congrats to you uh, with the Kobe Pro Tro. $45. We can't see what size this one is, uh, but Kid Jr. 24, $45 for the NXT. Hustle Crow also got the lime green one and a couple, and there's another one down here. Antonio Mendez, those are clean Vapor Max, uh, Vapor Max Triple Black, Fly Knit, and Mamba Focus in Hustle B colorway. I need those Kobe's. Damn, those Kobe's though. Uh, Pro Tro and Lime Green Kobe. Lime Green definitely rare. Insane Pro Tro fine. Pro Tro ones. We got the beautiful number eight on there too. Now we're getting into the foam posits. Oh man, people are just finding so much heat right now. Foam posits, 365 deals, one hit of flippa as well. And GTD sourcing. We got one, two, three. It looks like three pairs there, two pairs here, four kicks, four flips. Now, <laughs> uh, Rubber City Resale had himself a day, um, which they're two totally different finds. I'm trying to figure this one out. So there's your Stussy Blazer, but Cleats, Kobe's, LeBron Flynit, or LeBron 15, sorry. And then we have the, oh, we got a Vapor Max right here. And then we got the Jordan Cleats. But then this day, we got different blazers. We got Air Force One High, Kobe's, Shocks, uh, more Kobe's. And I can't even see what else is in here. Um, uh, looks like, man, I can't even see. And of course, it's Vapor Max, but man, uh, must be nice. Insider info, um, <laughs> fire. Let's see, that Ross is hustling. Top right is from a whole nother state. And this one, what? Top left, Ross opening in Brooklyn, Ohio. Oh, there we go. Let me see. Happy with the one-off and insane. And I am Rubber City Resale. So Kyle is here in the house. Undercover reseller. We got a couple of Puma cleats. If you guys have probably been seeing these out there in the wild. Tennis, Hardens, Foam Posit. And we did have these VaporMax for kids at our outlets. And now they're gone. And I believe they're 39 bucks. And then, of course... Cleats, Stone Builder 23 cleats, and the uh, 270s. Uh, those are nice, though, Jordan 9. Undercover reseller again. And we got more cleats. We got the Air Force One Low. And man, more, more stuff in here. I can't even see. We also have Carolina Kicks. Those are nice. A Vapor Max Flying It in like a gray and black. Also got the Utilities, Safari Golf, a Vapor Max 2019. Uh, Bolo every day, foam posits, the 97s, the Kobe's, everything in here. But smooth sailing had to outdo it with Air Force One, Air Force One, beautiful LeBrons. But we're here for the nursing shoe. This is what does it. Smooth sailing. Um, oh, man, that nursing shoe. There'll be a day when I find those. Uh, but that's wild, finding these things. Um, <laughs> let me see. What time do Ross restock? Smooth, Stevie D. 
Uh, why does that go for so much money, Doug the Pug? Uh, that's a good question. Uh, the nurses love them. What can I say? And that was it. So that was our last slide. Power rankings this week. TJ Maxx just straight up blew it. One, well, actually half a star. Didi's with one. Burlington at three. Marshall's at four. And Ross, five stars. Jay, it's a nursing thing. Big money. Nursing shoes. So I believe it is time. We got the giveaway. Ross, 30 bucks. And where am I? Did I freeze? Or let me get this out of the way. No, I'm not frozen. We're still here. Make sure I can see myself. 30 bucks from Rouse. And all you got to do is put some, uh, <laughs> put some photos together as far as most listings to least. And here we go. In order, most to least. Thank you to One Hit a Flippa with the foams. Common Fan Finds with the Jordan Cleat or Golf Shoe. Ronzo's with the Wheat Up Tempo. And Drum the Hustler with the Dornbecker React Element. So all you got to do is think about it. Which ones have you seen a lot of? Which one have you seen at all? What makes more sense? Most listing to least. Make sure I got my answer. Let me see. And I believe I have it here. And, oh man, where is it? I thought I, okay, here it is. Found my answer. Let me go back. Remember, my chat looks a little bit different. I'll take a screenshot if you don't believe me. Because sometimes it happens. Uh, there's so many answers coming in at once. And here we go. Texas Pete, no. Look on three legs, no. To cat, Texas Pete. Oh, man. All right. I don't want to lose this. Brian. Very close. Um, let's see. On nap. No. Stevie D. No. LP Cells. No. Hustle Crow. No. Ross Shallington. No. Kyle. Very close. Gucci Skunk. No. Uh, Middle M. No. Felicia. No. Uh, let's see, Doug the Pug, no, Sneaky Feet, no, we keep going down, Anna, Anna, you have won, Anna Weatherford won at G9H5 is the answer we were looking for, Common Fan Finds with the Jordan Golf 197 listings out there, Foam Posits, a little bit less than 100, Ronzo's with 51, Dorn Becker at 43. So G9H5 and congrats. So that was a nice one. Um, putting these together. So here's a question. Even though 197, are you still getting these? Are you still smashing and or passing for this one? Uh, 197 on the Jordan Golf. There were $25 though, so... And now, the moment you've been waiting for, who are top hustlers? And our top hustler is going into becoming closer to be our March Hustler Hog. We have Rubber City Resale, who dominated Smooth Sailing, Ronzo's 15, and Sneaky Flips. All four of them are getting in. We actually added a little bit more than usual. So right now, we have Thrifting Together, Flex on eBay, Jay Reynolds, Rubber City Resale, Sneaky Flip, Smooth Sailing, and Ronzo's are all in for March Hustler Hog. Now, um, I thought about the Kobe's. I thought about now that we got releases that are going to be coming out later. So we're going to make March good, and I'll keep you posted on what we decide to do. <laughs> um, Dapper Fanatic, Russo Resales, right now. I haven't created their banners yet for the Hall of Fame, but I'll do that. All right, let me go, Sue. Uh, let me see. Uh, thank you, Ross. Grand opening. Uh, Anna says, thanks. You got that. Uh, let me see. Tiger Woods are at 500. One hit a flip up. Um, please make TJ Maxx great again, Hustle Crow. And uh, get it from Patrick. All right. I felt like I had a burp or something. Okay, let me get this out of the way. Get this here. Stop screen. 
man, we, uh, we rolled through that live show. We are past our hour, but anything you want to add in, anything you want to say, uh, we haven't, let's see, my goal is to be a hustler hog. You can and you will. Um, let me see. Got to dip early every week, so now I can hear my drop. See you, baby. Steve, Stevie D, we'll see you. See you, baby. Um, you're right about going to grand opening, smooth sailing. Yeah, grand openings don't mess around, especially for Ross. Burlington, uh, they're still great too, but just Burlington hasn't had the quality of fines that um, that we've seen right now at Ross. So um, happy camper. Don't worry. You will be in. Like I said, as long as you're submitting and you're posting and you're here for the live shows, trust me, there's plenty of times people will get in. For Hustler Hog at some point. Um, oh, NJ Hypebeast Hustle. Nice, Tom. Um, so it's good to see the names behind the Instagram names because sometimes it's kind of hard to figure that out. Um, all right. And Middle Limb, another one, $1.99. And do you like chicken nuggets? I do like chicken nuggets. But from uh, Bert, wait, Wendy's, spicy chicken nuggets. Would you buy Junior Elite cleats? Honestly, I probably would not. Because um, I have bought some before, and they were very slow selling. Um, so I probably would not. Also depends on who else is, uh, how many of them are really, really out there um, comes into play. Spicy Nuggies. <laughs> um, I started low-key reselling after seeing your vids. Salute to Sir. Appreciate that. Food Stamp Poppy. <laughs> Uh, would you buy a uh, Jordan 14? Depends. Like what color? What's the price? Are you picking up any golf cleats? Um, only ones I did pick up were the Safari ones that I saw at Ross. I have not seen any other ones at Burlington. Um, I think the Flyknit one you guys saw in a video, but I haven't seen like the Jordan one. I haven't seen, I haven't even seen Tiger Woods yet in my area. So I don't know. I don't know what happened there. Uh, 97 Tiger Camo, a good find. Depends on the price as well and what size. Um, because I've seen some that are, they still do print on demand. Um, I haven't uploaded anything in a long time. I still get a small check every month from my shirts that I've uploaded for the two years or whatever, how long I was doing it, but I haven't uploaded anything new. And here's the new Kobe coming out April 1st. And yes, the new Kobe, I believe, uh, AD wore them for the all-star game. So that one, uh, those are pretty dope though. Um, let's see. Chick-fil-A Nuggies smack and smash the like. Ecom Moose 499. Thank you for that, my boy, Moose. And uh, would you buy uh, Giannis basketball shoes? Um, I don't mind them. I think some pretty, that's some pretty sick colorways. Um, but I believe they're going to hit the outlets. Some already have, so might just wait and get the right price. Cool. Thanks for the live show. Miles, thanks for being here every single week. And everybody else that's also here every single week, dedicated. And, of course, tagging me on all your finds. So Friday, I got Ross video. I don't know yet for Monday. And, of course, the next Wednesday, live show as usual. So I'll see you guys. Go out and 